Okay, so you are going to have to bear with me because these boxes are rather full and it's a little bit of a mess. But I said I was going to run a giveaway when I got to a thousand. Um, I haven't got there yet, but I am trying to clear up my vast array of mess. And these boxes are just sitting there and I've been adding extra bits. So I am going to show everybody what's in them. Originally, the giveaway was just going to be for the UK only, which is going to be this box. It's not a nail mail box. I'm just reusing the box um, and it's going to have gels in it. But then I noticed quite a lot of my readers are America way. And then I felt kind of bad. So I've recycled a second box, which will not have gel in it because obviously it's a no-no. So I'm going to do the competition, I believe, as an Enter UK. And then as an Enter... I don't know to do it, Enter International. And that one won't have gels in it. will be a slightly smaller box as well due to postage costs. But I thought I would give everybody a rundown on what is in them. Mm, if you've watched past videos, you've already seen what's in the England one. Look at the mess. But I did add more to it. So I thought I would go back through it. Um, as you can see, it's rather full. One second. I just thought I would show everybody what is in them. Um, so they can see what they were getting, basically. Okay, so... This is the UK box. We've got some of the little sponge dabbies. I have a set of two bone heart charms, gold foil, some sequins. I have angel glow. This is glow in the dark pigment powder. I have white texture gel, which is the gypsum gel from Rachel Wilders. I have a gel polish holder. This is the Evolve 4 in 1 gel that I like to use, you know, when I'm doing raised lines with chrome. There's a tub of that. And that is the Molding Mirror one. This is the 15 second one, which gives the, you know, like the wavy lines and things. You see me use that one quite a lot. I have some pink chrome, some little pearls. We have a brush rest, a silicone dibby dabby. I have a set of dibby dabbies. There's going to be lots of dibby dabbies in this because I can't remember the name. We have the triangles. I've got a couple of firm dibby dabbies in there. I have some of my favourite scrubby brushes. They're great for just hooking over your finger and doofy in. Okay, so we have a box of mixed petals. I won't get this in as tidy as I did before. These are mixed shapes in pastels. I have some more chrome. This, I think this is like a, like a white see-through and this is like the, the donut you craze thing. Um, I put a couple of my little piggies in there because I just think they were really cute. There is some mixed glitters. They're popped in there. I've got two of my silicone molds. This one is Doggy Bones and Paw Prints. And this one is the letters that I used to write fall and autumn with on some of the design. I ordered an extra one of those. And inside this is actually another one which does snowflakes. So that's in there as well. I have a stamper and scraper. Some Maddie Dabbies. I have a rhinestone picker. And you've got your wax at one end and your purple at the other. I have a sheet of silver lines. I have some mixed shapes in different colours in there. Which is a very full box. Now I like to keep these bags and reuse them so everything is in there but there is a mix of gold and silver charms, acrylic charms, there's some diamonds in there. There is a little bit of everything in there. I have some decals from Queen of Decals. Now these are, these go on any colour background. 
Now this one is just a size placement sheet so you know how to use them and it gives you a couple of different designs but I've left full instructions in there for you. There's two there. I also put a pack of Karomian because she's adorable and some Autumn Gonks which I'd ordered a second of. And I have a couple of stamping plates for you. There's this one. This is an overlap one, which would be really, really good for autumn. Not the time of year for it now, but I've been hoarding this box for a while. And some letters. I have some reflective swooshes. Um, some more transfers. These ones are not white ink, um, so these will need to go on a white background. I've left the Queen of Decals ones together. But if you're unsure, just pop me a note. And then, while shopping on Ali, I bought myself what I thought was single packs of stickers. And it wasn't. It was huge multi-packs. So, let me just peel those ones out. Because they're not included. Well, they are, but not in this description. So, you have the mother load of... Mixed designer from Louis Vuitton, Playboy, Chanel, Fendi, Versace, Nike, Kappa, Gucci. You've got a whole shit ton of designer stickers. We've got some dragon stickers. Some letter stickers for the, the raised seal Korean design nails. Um, I did one quite, quite a while back, but if you search back through my videos, if you haven't seen it already... Um, it shows you how to do it without the Korean products, just using gel polish and acrylic. We have some winter stickers, some cute little fruit stickers, some summer stickers, some cute stickers, some bunny. I love these bug stickers. And these ones glow in the dark. So that is the UK box. I may add some gel polishes to it, I'm not sure. We will have to wait and see. And this box is going to be the international America, wherever you live, that's not England box. So, I have a bag with some different transfer foils in. I have a really cute little teddy bear mold. This is one of the ones you put the gel polish in. I have some of the same crumb powder I've put in the other one. Let me move some of that out. We have a card and stamper. I have filled this with a mix of gold and silver and coloured charms. Um, this baggie is full of acrylic charms and there's some designer ones in there as well. I have a rhinestone picker as well. Another silicone Dibby Dabby. Another Dibby Dabby. Two little pots of dotty glitter. And we've got some red and pink flowers and butterflies and hearts. This one is a mix of flower petals, butterflies, hearts. But they are all different colours. A pastel pink and gold set. I've got some cute little stars and some they are flowers and butterflies. I just thought if you are in America and that's where this one ends up they would be cute for the 4th of July maybe. Um, I have some stamping plates for you as well. This one is like lace designs. This one is still in its wrapper because sometimes I'd be on Sheen or Timu or other places and I'd see things I wanted specifically for the giveaway boxes. So this one has like checked patterns and kind of like a swirly. We have an animal print. Um, I will go past and play it. I have one of these and I absolutely love it. My daughter says that they all look like squishmallows. 
So there is a Squishmallow slash Caplet. And this one I also have. I actually haven't used mine yet. Because I need to pick up some more stamping polishes. Because I wanted it to be like... I wanted to colour the flowers in for spring. But I don't have those colours. I only bought art some colours. So that is in there. You also have the ridiculous mother load of designer nail stickers. Um, with some Christmas ones, some cute Halloweens and some really nice blue flowers. Um, I obviously can add gel polish into this one with it going international. But I just wanted to show you what was in that as well. So, I am going to leave my socials in the description. And to enter the competitions, um, you need to like the video be subscribed to my channel and to subscribe to and to follow me on instagram please and you also need to put enter uk if you are in the uk that is for this box now if you are an international friend and follower same rules apply i need you to like the video i need you to be subscribed to my channel and to be following me on Instagram, which I will put in the description box. And you please need to put Enter Me International. And that is for the white box. Um, I will put the rules up in the description box again, just in case anybody missed it. Or anybody muted me because they got sick of listening to me. Which is fair enough. I get sick of listening to myself. And I will give it... A couple of weeks and then I'll draw it Um, I will do it with one of the random generators um, on my phone and I'll film it so you can see it I've seen people use like YouTube comment generators or randomizers or something so I'll do it that way so you can see it so I'll put the rules up for you so remember enter me UK or enter me international and you need to like the video subscribe to me on YouTube and follow me on Instagram and I'll be back with another video shortly, guys. Good luck.